Hello, I'm Kim Rooster Rossiter and live from Hampton, Virginia's Sandy Bottom Park, this is Spotlight Saturday, episode 17. Hey everybody, I hope that you enjoyed that introduction that you just saw with the video and the photos and the new music. Briley revealed that in episode 16, we're showing again in 17. She's going to change the introduction up over the next three, four, five episodes, and then we're going to hold a vote to see which one of the introductions you like the best. If you want to have your photos or videos included in the introduction, just let us know when you have it recorded, of course using your phone and filming horizontally, and we can get you a Dropbox link to drop it to, and if it's good quality and good stuff, Riley can include it in one of those possible introductions. And then we're going to use the winner of the introduction of, of the actual intro. We're going to have that in a series of probably 10 episodes consecutively. So looking forward to your involvement and assistance and voting in that process. All right, look, let's jump into this episode. We've got some fun stuff and huge announcements that we want to give to you this week. First off, I want to say congratulations to our friends, our ambassadors, our family down in central Mississippi. They rocked out the cannonball roll this morning. Well, this would be the second time uh, in 2016 that the Angels Angels Race Series events have been kicked off. We have another four races scheduled for the rest of the season, and we're really excited about those. The particular race this morning was the third annual Cannonball Roll, so we're really, really happy for all of our ladies and all of our runners and all of our ambassadors, everybody down there in central Mississippi who rocked out the event this morning, so congratulations. Um, the next big thing I want to let you know about is that the race series is going to be going to Lake Charles, Louisiana on 16 July, and I want you to stay tuned to this episode. We've got a huge announcement we're revealing on this episode at the end of this video, so stay tuned for that. Don't fast forward. Now, as we go into this particular week, uh, one of the things that we want to highlight today, especially, is a special event that happened last week. Jessica, as you're aware, is traveling around the United States and running 50 marathons, one in each state. And as she tackles those marathons, having already gone to Oregon, Virginia, and last week, Kentucky, she's giving away Freedom Push Chairs. So, we want to have an opportunity to give you an update from her here in just a moment. But before we get to that, I want you to understand that I I did the introduction to this video from a place called Sandy Bottom in Hampton, Virginia. I want to go back out to myself to give you more information about what was going on last Saturday morning. Flip it to myself now. Hello everybody. So one of the things that you may not know is happening right now is that Joe Orth, our operations officer, as well as his fiance Leanne, the Hampton Roads Ambassador, they're running a 24-hour race for the cure, specifically for cancer, and they've dedicated all of their fundraising efforts to go half to the American Cancer Society and half to Ainsley's Angels in Hampton Roads. And half of us and, are here right now. And how is that for timing? Yes, he didn't know I was here. He just came around the corner. What mile at you at right? Are you at right now? Uh, just under 39. Just under 39 miles. I mean, he's got 40 miles to go, and Leanne is somewhere back here. We're going to wait for her and get her on the clip here in a minute, but uh, how you feeling right now? Feeling good. A little yeah. beat up, but yeah. spirits are high. Yeah, that's good. Good weather. That's awesome. I'm excited to be here. I have a couple laps with them. We can yeah. work out. And uh, Leanne, from what I understand, she just recently accomplished She's a big She's an goal. ultra marathon. Ultra yeah. marathon. She, again, she doesn't know I'm here yet, but I, I brought her, her her 50K. I hope that she's hit 31 miles. Maybe she's just short of that. But she's not only going for 50K today, she's going for a, for 50 miles. So uh, we're here to encourage her. And uh, anyway, hope you all enjoy the episode. We're going to have some uh, maybe some one-on-one -on -one later with Joe and or Leanne, possibly. Uh, in this episode. But anyway, kick back, uh, sit back, and relax, and we'll see y'all soon. The water bottles are working great. Oh, yes, water bottle. Good plug. Nice pro <laughs> product placement. <laughs> well, how's that for timing? Look at that. Shortly after I hit pause, Miss Leanne decided to grace us with her presence. Um, it gives me great honor to present to Woo! you your 50K sticker, Yay! ultra marathoner. She Yay! earned that thing. And what are you running for today? What are you doing um, out here? I'm out here for Ainsley's Angels and American Cancer Society and all those that have been affected by the nasty cancer. And so how do you feel? How do you feel right now? You, you're an ultra marathoner. What's that mean? I feel wobbly. Can you hold me up? <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know. What's it mean though? What's it feel like? Um, it's an honor. Yes. Not everyone can do this. Yes. And I'm surprised that I did. So. Yes. yes, you did. Well, awesome. Well, we're going to let you keep moving. Okay. And uh, we're going to come back shortly. But uh, yeah, hey, ultra marathoner. Hey. 
again, a huge congratulations to both Joe and Leanne. Their dedication to the causes that they were running to last Saturday was truly, truly amazing to watch and experience. I had the honor of spending uh, about the, the last 21 miles with them, and uh, their, their, their energy and their motivation and their drive truly lived up to the idea of all things advocate, educate, and celebrate. We truly had a good time, and uh, they're going to be able to give about $1,000 to the American Cancer Society here coming up really soon as a result of that effort. So again, kudos and congratulations. Hey, the next segment of this Spotlight Saturday, actually, I need to uh, take my jacket off to introduce. Uh, we're all familiar with Jessica. We've had a chance to learn her story. Uh, let's go ahead and kick it out to her and see what's going on with that motivating uh, 50 Gifts of Freedom project. Jessica? Hey, guys, it's Jessica. I'm coming at you from Kentucky, 50 Gifts of Freedom project. It's our third state, third race, and we're going to go in here and give our gift away to Levi, who's our cheer recipient for Kentucky. Um, they have no idea that they're getting a race cheer today. We're gonna do it before the race because Levi's rolling in the half marathon instead of the full marathon with me today. Um, so let's go and surprise Levi. Girl I heard that you really well, love running. <laughs> Do you like running with Ainsley's Angels? Rolling with the wind? Yeah. I hear that. <laughs> I hear you've been rolling here in Kentucky. Well, Levi, I came from North Carolina and I'm here for Ainsley's Angels of America. And what I'm doing is called the 50 Gifts of Freedom Project. And I'm doing a marathon in each state. And in each state, I wanted to find a special boy or girl who can roll in their own race chariot so that they can roll in as many races as they want <laughs> and to be, part, <laughs> to be part of our Ainsley's Angels family. What do you think about that? So right around... Right around the corner here, Miss PK is going to get it. Look what we have for you. Look. It's Team Levi's Chariot. That's, that's going to be all yours, buddy. Okay, all yours. You like that? How does it look? Does it look fast? Yeah. You can go fast. What do you tell people when they're running? That's awesome stuff, Jessica. Awesome stuff. Of course, everybody, the next one coming up is going to be Vermont. Uh, Jessica's already put a lot of movement into play. I think she even found her rider athlete for that motivating marathon up in Vermont coming up soon. So stay tuned for more details on that. Hey, our last segment of this, I'm, I'm just over the moon excited to announce. This is a huge announcement. And uh, I want to flip it over to my good friend Tim over there at iRun4 to go ahead and make the announcement. Tim, go ahead. Take it away. That's right, Rooster. We have a huge announcement. I'm Tim Boyle, founder of I Run For, and what we're gonna do is we're going to meet up with Ainsley's Angels in Lake Charles, Louisiana, July 16th. It is going to be a blast. Uh, the gauntlet has been thrown in, in Rooster's direction, so he has promised to make this particular meetup, an I Run For meetup, and to make it the largest to date. Uh, that's That's gonna be big, it's gonna be tough to do, but if anyone's going to do it, it's going to be it's going to be him, and it's going to be us. Together we shall, Rooster. So there you go. There it is. The gauntlet's been thrown down. I understand the record is 125 I Run 4 members. I think we can blow that out of the way, out of the water completely at the third annual Sunset 5K. We're going to have details uploaded to the website. Riley's going to put the link down below. The highlights are, though, it's an evening run, which is just super awesome. We watch the sunset. We run the 5K. Of course, pre prior to the race and after the race, an absolute party. Uh, we've got all kind of Louisiana cuisine that's part of the 
Finishers Festival. Anybody and everybody that's there can get involved in that process. Um, every type of Louisiana cuisine. Our friends at the Louisiana Marathon gave us the idea years ago. We picked up with it and been running with it. That whole Louisiana family down in Lake Charles have absolutely put on an amazing event. So the third annual Sunset 5K, 16 July, Lake Charles, Louisiana. I run for Link Up. It's going to be awesome. We're going to all get there. In fact, I understand that even my buddy, who I run for, Kendall Jade, is coming down. And we've got plans for Kendall Jade and I to run the race together. So we hope all of you can come from all over the United States. Again, thank you, Tim, for partnering in this event. We're super excited about the I Run For Ainsley's Angels marriage that we've had here for the past few years and the amazing things to come. Congratulations again to Joe and Leanne and Jessica. You're absolutely inspiring us all with your amazing gifts of freedom across the United States. All right, everybody. Again, remember to stay tuned and vote for your favorite uh, introduction over the the next couple of episodes and if you haven't got us on snapchat instagram subscribe to the youtube channel and all that other stuff now's the time to do it have a wonderful rest of your weekend and we'll see you next week a young angel.